Hi, this is Premium Spanner Tutorial, part 18, Empty with Constraint. Now, Empty is a special object in Blender. You can scale it, you can rotate it, you can grab it, but it doesn't show anything in the rendered field. Now, the first time I create Empty, I just know like what does it do. But then I realized Empty just asks as the operator of the other object. So, so basically you um, add a constraint on the Empty to manipulate another object and then you will ask like what is constraint constraint is like you give a principle you give a root between two objects just like the previous tutorial I have um, introduced parent is one of the constraint that the child object have to follow the parent object now for instance I just try to create another empty object just next to the group and then I choose the group go to the property windows and then I find the constraint and I choose copy rotation now after I doing that you'll see that if I rotate the empty object the cube will rotate as well so this is one of the way we use empty for sometimes maybe there is a lot of object maybe like a female groups and you want to rotate them all together and control by one operator now let's try to duplicate the cubes four more times and that's a really good thing about duplicate it also duplicate constraint as well but of course in F5 if you don't want to copy this setting you can change the things you want to duplicate in the user preference but anyway this is how MT does and this MT help a lot in the animation we're going to do in the filters so let's try another way to use the MT MT can add as a focus point of the camera as well for instance um, Let's imagine your camera is moving. It won't stay on the target when you move it. In this case, we want to use the empty to put a focus on it. Now we want the camera to focus on the top of the cubes. So we choose the cube, we tap to the edit mode, we choose the top vertex, and we slap the cursor to select it. Then we tap it to object mode, and we add an empty. Now we choose the camera, and then we choose the empty and then we press ctrl t to check to constraint now when you move the camera you can see that wherever the camera is moving it will focus on the empty this is really good when you're doing an animation to focus on the character